At six, U.S. Customs and Border Protection tell News for Tucson it is now reviewing safety measures at all Border Patrol checkpoints. This after our reporting last month that the union representing Border Patrol agents wanted to see more safety procedures. And our chief investigative reporter, Corus Nylander, broke the story and now joins us live from the I-19 checkpoint. Uh, and they're calling for safety out there, Corus. Yeah, well, Monica, we have repeatedly asked CBP leadership what they plan to do after at least three crashes at checkpoints in Arizona just this year. And now, after nearly a month, we know they plan to take a close look at safety measures at every single checkpoint, including the one right here behind me. It was the end of October. Two Border Patrol agents were seriously injured after a truck slammed into the checkpoint on Interstate 8 east of Yuma. It was the latest in a series of close calls at other Arizona checkpoints. Back in June, a speeding and impaired driver, according to investigators, crashed into the checkpoint near Tombstone. Luckily, there were no major injuries. In March, a man evading police in a stolen truck crashed into the checkpoint on Highway 90 near Sierra Vista. No agents were injured. They need to take the right precautions, obviously, when it comes to putting some of these uh, checkpoints together. Art Del Cueto, vice president of the National Border Patrol Council, told News 4 Tucson in October that he wants to see more safety measures in place after the series of crashes. There's a lot of issues going on on the southern border. We've all heard about it, but uh, we cannot take any type of shortcuts to uh, make sure that all the agents, uh, their safety is first and foremost what they need to look at. October 23rd, we asked CBP leadership if there was any plans to review or address safety at checkpoints. We never received a response until this afternoon. A CBP spokesperson telling us, quote, the United States Border Patrol is steadfastly committed to the safety of its frontline personnel. Nothing is more important than ensuring that our workforce safely gets home at the end of each shift. USBP is currently assessing safety measures at all of its checkpoints. And only time will tell if CBP's assessments will lead to any significant changes. We'll keep you updated. We're live near the I-19 Border Patrol checkpoint tonight. Corus Snylander, News 4 Tucson.